Happy Easter to everybody in the HCPT family and welcome to Lourdes. We've been here a couple of days with the advance team getting everything ready and what a day Easter Monday was. Well, the first day of an, of an HCPT pilgrimage for three years and it's amazing to be back. We began with our pilgrims traveling from England, Ireland, Poland and Scotland who all flew and made their way by all the different routes that were possible to our spiritual home here in Lourdes where they've all been joined by representatives from um, our friends in America and the West Indies, our, our sister organisations. And walk. Wait, pretend you're going to the airport. No, you were meant to walk. Walk. It's a film. Video. Yeah. Sc Scottish contingent heading to Lourdes team. to Lord itself off this is us Apre the flight heading to our hotel so the groups have now all arrived and after a slightly later lunch in their hotels where they've found their rooms and found their bearings again um, the groups wasted no time as you can imagine getting out into the town first stop for many down to the grotto then obviously the cafes and, and just reacquainting themselves with everything that, that Lourdes has to offer. You would have seen many of them come down to our new base, which is the Espace Mission, where we've got our shop and our reception, and also our fun zone, where they will be helping to prepare brightly colorful um, imagery and art for use in our liturgies later in the week. In the afternoon, we had our first mass as a pilgrimage together, celebrated by Father John Carroll, HCPT Trust Chaplain and what a celebration it was, a great way to start the week's pilgrimage together. So it's been an amazingly fun-packed and prayerful day here in Lourdes and it didn't end as, the, as we got into the evening as we saw all of our young people gather in the St Bernadette Church for their youth event, hosted and led by one of our service groups, 709, from the Brentwood Diocese and the Brentwood Youth Service. 
We then, at the, well, at the same time, there was a, a presentation given um, about Brother Michael and the, uh, the process for his canonization. Lots of people very interested in getting involved in that. And then our day ended with a most beautiful evening mass at half past ten at the Grotto. A wonderful privilege for HCPT to be given that, uh, that opportunity to lead a mass which is very rarely said in English at the Grotto. A lovely way to end the first day. Thanks for joining us today and sharing this most special experience with us. A couple of things to highlight for you tomorrow. Uh, in the morning we have our Welcome Mass which is uh, led by Archbishop Leo, our President, and also the HCPT Torchlight Procession in the evening where we work with the Shrine to um, pray the Rosary with not just the HCPT family but the global family here in Lourdes. So once again Follow us on social media and you won't miss a thing. Bye.